Hey, my dudes, one sec. Gotta set up the stream real quick. Okay, okay, I'm about ready to go. Hello, hello, everybody. Yo. Just discovered the channel, huh? Well, that's good to hear. <laughs> I've only been doing uh, YouTube for a little while. Not that long. But. Okay, I think I'm ready to go now. Yeah. Um, yesterday I had an appointment. I didn't get enough time with the Pure Wizard, so I figured I would do Pure Wizard again today. It's like, today I'll have, like, three or t maybe two or three hours. Yesterday I had two or three hours, so if you combine them, it's like six hours. I got my Blue Mountain Dew right here. But, let's have a quick look at the build. Um, I don't know if I need to talk about this again. I think you guys have seen the build before, but loose at staff for more damage. We've got this to amplify any carry and sword sorceries, which are the most important thing. We've also got this here because it's fashionable. We've got these three talismans for magic damage. We've got this for casting speed. And here is the build. Radon hunting. <laughs> well, um... You know, whenever I actually want to run into Radons in this game, I can't find them. Yeah, Blue Mountain Dew is Glintstone. It's like, it matches. Um, fuck, what was I gonna say? Dude, I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh yeah, the whole point of this is like, uh... Pure Wizard is like really overpowered, right? It's one of the most overpowered things, but... If you don't know how to play it, it's not very good. It's like, it's one of those things that's only good if you have, like, knowledge of it. It's in the right hands, you know? And it's funny how you said that Blue Mountain Dew is Glenstone flavored. That's funny. <laughs> but yeah, the build's pretty simple. Um, every time I pick this build up, I gotta, like, get reused to it. Because I'm just... It, it's hard to... Once you've been doing melee for a while, when you start picking up the wizard, everything's different, you know? I've got all my melee shit, though. i got all my usual stuff here. Like my Karen Piercer, and my Bonk, and my annoying Pew Pews. But, you know, mo most wizards play like fucking idiots. Most wizards play like fucking idiots. If you play it right, it's one of the strongest builds in the game. If not the strongest. But let's see how I do today. I had kind of a rough day yesterday getting used to this build. <laughs> That's what the blue flask is in Elden Ring. It's fucking Mountain Dew Voltage. We fucking figured it out just now. Oh no, I'm in the wrong spot. Yeah, I'm in... Uh, can I get up there? Dude... This game and its its fucking spawns are infuriating. Now I gotta go fight that goddamn dragon too. All right, let her rip. Well, uh, was that the host? Goddamn. Yeah, see, pure mage is uh, very balanced and fair. That was a good uh, warm-up invasion, I guess. <laughs> Damn, bro. 
You guys get to the live stream real fast. It's crazy. Will I ever learn how to keep up with the stream chat? Probably not. Oh yeah, perfectly balanced. Especially when there's three wizards all, all you know, attacking you. I wonder if it put me in the right place this time. If it's if you're in Kalid, you're probably not gonna be spawned in the right spot. That's just the reality of it. Do we have a solo host? Hold on, let me check. Oh, there's a, there should be a summon here. There should be. Hello? Where's the summon though? I don't hear him. The summon must be hiding. You ready to fight? Is this a fucking cosplay right now? Uh huh. I'm over here, dude. Oh! Daddy's here! He is also a wizard. Cool. Bad frame. Not the Elden Stars, no. I'm not fucking doing the Elden Stars. Not in an enclosed space like this. I'm not doing it. I'll just fucking leave until that's done. That's how we do this. Where's the summon? He's trying to come up behind me. Hello? Damn, bro. He takes a lot of damage to that shield. Oh no, he's lagging. He was lagging pretty hard too. A little bit scary. Carrion Slicer is absolutely fucking evil. Ow. God damn it. I don't have any poise damage. This guy, I'm not sure if this guy knows what he's doing or not. He's kind of weird. One-handed spear, dude. I'm worried about this blue. I don't know where this blue is at. You always gotta watch out for the blue. Ugh, I can't tell if that's lag or if he's actually good. Rip. Uh, I think it was latency, honestly. That was a little bit questionable. His 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 uh, latency. Well, that was a good that was a good warm up. It wasn't too hard. It wasn't too easy. A little scary though, not knowing where the fucking blue is. Excuse me. So sorry. I'm disgusting. Oh man, I'd be burping. That's disgusting. What's up, everybody? For those that are just getting to the live stream, uh, I didn't have enough time with the pure wizard yesterday, so I decided to give it another day. Probably gave it like two or three hours today, because I have another appointment today. But yesterday, I was like having trouble getting used to the wizard, because like one of the biggest issues with it is getting used to using the wizard after you've been a melee build. You know, it's just a lot different. You, you, it takes a minute to get used to it. Burp souls. That's disrespectful, bro. That's just disrespectful. Cowabunga! No! Melina, stop! I had to do that before Melina fucking wrecked my shit. Look at this motherfucker. Look at her. She's fucking insane. She is the most spammiest motherfucker in this entire game. Dumb invasion. Stupid invasion. Like, just, just don't let me invade there. Just don't let me fucking play there. I don't want to play there. Yeah, dude. Melina is the spammer. Like, the original fucking... Spammer, like that's that's Miyazaki's favorite character right there. That shit's impossible to deal with. There's gankers that go to that spot and summon Melina on purpose just to just to like irritate you, just just to be annoying, and it works. What's everybody saying? <laughs> Hey, Drunk, have you met genuinely skilled gankers here? What, like at the stairs? At the Morgoth stairs? I mean, 
I don't think so. Dude, like, to be honest with you, 95% of gankers don't know how to play. So it's not that common, honestly. And it, the 5% that do know how to play, they're ganking because they're afraid to lose. You know, they just want to play on easy mode. Even though they can play, they know how. They're just playing on easy mode. So they're either really bad or really insecure. That that would be the only two reasons you gank. And I just don't think they're very good players on average. I, you like Elden Ring, but you hate how it's become spam souls. I mean, me too, bro. I, when the game first came out, I was uh, still bitching about all the spam and all the projectiles. I was, I'm not going to say I pioneered that movement, but I was bitching about it pretty early on, honestly. I already saw the problems before, you know, it became widespread. I already understood why this was going to be an issue. Yeah, one more wizarding stream. Then we'll switch to something else tomorrow. Or no, actually, not tomorrow, because tomorrow is YouTube video day. Tomorrow I gotta make a video. But today it's a stream. I'm gonna try to alternate between days. Dude, I gotta stop ending these invasions so quick. I gotta stop this. He don't even care. Oh, you can't play without daddy, huh? Get bonked. Motherfucker. In the dirt. Wow. That was actually pathetic. Slade Wilson, the returned man. <laughs> I remember your name used to be just Slade Wilson. Why are you the returned man now, I wonder? You should probably explain the, the lore. I know you got some lore. Who do you think is the best invader? PvP enjoyer in Elden Ring. Um... I mean, here's the thing. I don't know if the actual best player is always going to be some someone that plays this game all the goddamn time. They probably don't have a YouTube channel, or they probably don't stream. They're probably completely unknown. That's probably the best player is someone like that. I guarantee it. But if you're talking about the best player that we know of, uh, I'd say G9 or Stolovsky. You know... I have a slight preference for G9, but I'm not sure which one of them is better, honestly. I, it could go either way. I kind of want to see them fight Stilovsky and G9, but I think it's between those two, probably. And thank you for the $2, my dude. Really appreciate it. Only been streaming like two minutes. There's already a $2 donation. Thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. And if you got any of that lore for the, for the name, I would like to know. A lot of good cr critique against Elden Ring. Talk about how FromSoft made spam the meta instead of unique builds that actually engage the game. I mean, yeah, bro. I I've literally been... Ever since I was able to use the community posts on YouTube, uh, I've been bitching about that. Legit. I've been bitching about it for a long time. Golem's Halberd. Hmm. I'm not sure I know about that one, to be honest. Godfrey Axe stream? I'm not opposed to it. I'm not opposed to it at all. Godfrey Axe is, like, really good, and people don't realize how good it is. There should be a cost attached to being good at range. I, I mean, there sort of is, but not really. It's a long story having to do with Marvel... I mean, you can tell the story if you want to. Yeah, I don't really know about the Golem Halberd, honestly. A lot of people have said that it's good, but I don't... It's one of those things I just haven't gotten to yet. Spammers last all but two seconds when you spam back at them in this game. Yeah, there's some truth to that. 
Well, the ones that are spamming are probably the ones that don't know how to play. That's just a statistical fact right there. I think I'm going to get fog wall, guys. Let's see where the host is. Wait a minute. Oh, he's right there. Is he solo? No, there should be two here. Should be. Yeah, fighting fire with fire. Fighting cancer with cancer. I don't know where this guy's going. Was he coming up to get me? Is that what he was doing? I think he went up here to get me. Hello? Wait! Stop! I'm right here! Oh, I'm getting fog walled yet. Why did he go up here? He could have just went down there. What the fuck? <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> they usually go the other way. I'm like, what the? <laughs> you want to fight? Fire in a hole! Oh, I hit him. Hell yeah. Ow! Jerk! No, that's the wrong spell. I almost did the wrong spell, bro. See, so take using some wizard, it takes getting used to for a minute. Alright, buddy. It's time. Okay, enjoy your solo boss fight. Did you guys see that? It took three slicers. Three goddamn slicers. Slicer doing 500 damage, bro. That's that's fucked up. That ain't that ain't right. Bear? I think my dog wants something. I don't know what he wants though. Did you guys hear my dog just now? I think we have a fog wall cheeser. Uh, I don't know if I can get through this. I'm not sure if I can get through this. Bear. He's, li he's literally right here. He's literally like, like two feet away from the microphone right now. Okay, so he actually went to do his solo boss fight. He's gonna lose, but... Alright, Bear. Bear. You gotta back up, buddy. You gotta back up. Go on. I'm working. Come on, Bear. One sec, guys. I gotta... I gotta... I gotta... Uh, figure out what Bear wants. Okay, it seems like he just wanted attention, honestly. He, he, it, when that dog wants attention, he's going to get it. You know, he, 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 he pretty much makes you pay attention to him. Oh, shit. I have a problem, guys. One sec. Can you guys give me just a moment? I gotta get help. I need a stream moderator. Because I haven't seen any of them here. Okay, let me see what you guys have been saying real quick. Oh, Pantera's here, okay. My hero! Yeah, when when Bear shows up, he just he'll get all he'll get all like pushy and try to make you pay attention to him. It's a uh, it's kind of funny, honestly. He's literally barked in my face because I wasn't paying attention to him. He wakes me up by barking when he wants attention. That dog is just when he wants attention, he's gonna make you give it. Fire in a hole! Ow. Dick. Whoa, what the? Oh god, I'm getting hit through the wall. I don't like it. Bad connection? Maybe. 
Fire and all! Fuck! I'm so bad at wizarding, huh? Okay, he had no vigor. Wow. One fucking cannon. Can't hit him. Oh, yeah, it was bad net. God damn you and your moon veil. Moon veil turn and burns piss me off when they're laggy. And that was a laggy one for sure. These guys are not the greatest in that. Ha ha! Moon veil that, bitch! Hang on, I gotta get up there in time. I gotta get up there. Oh, yeah! How you like that, bitch? Okay. Dude, the wizard took off, didn't he? Really, bro? You standing in the goddamn circle? That was not the play. <laughs> Fucking fishbowl having motherfucker. Oh man, Just look at this stupid blue. You already lost. You've already lost. Fucking fishbowl wizards. That's the type of wizard right there that gives all wizards a bad name. They give all wizards a bad name. Honestly, though. I would like to take a moment to read up the chat. If you guys would be so kind as to let me. Chase, Lost, and Drunk are your favorite YouTubers. Huh. That's interesting that I'm included in that list. That's that's strange. A Night Comet one-shot build in this game? Yes, I have. I made a Night Sorcerer, like, Spellblade thing. Uh, I think I have two of those on the, on the YouTube channel, actually. Yeah, this is the same build from yesterday. I'm just going through and catching up with all the stuff I missed real quick. But yeah, it's the same build. Uh, I didn't get enough time with this build yesterday, so I decided to play it again. I gotta... Damn. I'm sorry, I'm so dysfunctional. I've always been dysfunctional, it's just today I'm a little bit more dysfunctional. You hate how certain places allow them to abuse the fog wall. Me too, man. I don't know why it's still in the game. They, they could have easily taken care of that issue by now. They just don't give a shit. And that's the most tragic part, honestly. Hello, Stark. I just realized you were here, Stark. One sixty eight and people still running around with thirty vigor. Yeah. Oh man. The player base makes me lose hope, honestly. Uh, I'm sorry, Slade, I missed your I missed your lore. I, I missed that because I was fighting that fishbowl wizard. My bad. I'm still trying to catch up. I didn't even catch up all the way. Damn it, bro. Nobody likes this fucking place. Nobody likes this place. What the fuck are you doing? Stupid ass game. Just don't let us invade here. Why, why are you slow walking? Oh. Oh shit, we got a solo. Fuck off. I checked, it, it's a solo.
I'm not gonna waste my time on solos today. I don't have time for it. Literally. I only got like two or three hours to stream today. I am not very comfortable. The my gaming chair is not the most comfortable at all. Gaming chair, quote unquote. New item idea: Super Mimic Tier. But it has a ten percent chance of summoning an invader. Ah, that's pretty fucking funny. I wish they would do something like that, bro. There's no cool mechanics like that anymore. There used to be like all these cool multiplayer mechanics and they just they just got rid of all of it because I guess because I don't know. I just I don't understand. There used to be, you know, player bosses. There used to be all kinds of covenant areas where, you know, there could be like 10 invaders in one world. There used to be, like, factions you could join in these games. And none of that is a thing now. That's one of the re the reasons people are mad about Covenants being gone. It's like, god damn it, I think we're having a... We need to restart real quick. Because it's being slow. Be <laughs> Miyazaki never liked invaders. <laughs> well, at least that's the perception. I feel like Miyazaki likes his multiplayer system, but he just doesn't... All of his energy goes into the fucking, you know, easy mode PvE experience in these games now. They do have that. When a player loses in the environment, you can see where they lost and how they lost. That's just a feature in this game too. You can see the the red the red outline of them, like how they lost. Yeah. Black flame build. I have I have a really good black flame build. It's pretty good. it's pretty damn good, honestly. It shreds, honestly. For some reason, we hit a slow spot in the invasions. Some days it just be slow like that. I don't know. Some days it just it just doesn't work right. What well, the weird thing about these games is that like we know there's invasions to be had, but then it just won't give them to you for some reason. Oh, do we have? Uh, are you guys ganking out here? Or what? No, I don't. I'm not. I'm not really sure at this point. I guess it doesn't matter, huh? They're all the same. Blue balls. I need help from the blue balls. Ah! Yeah, there's star shower. Got to get away from the star shower. That's a problem right there I need to get away from. It doesn't matter if I'm a wizard. There's still a star shower. I need to get away from it. Fighting more than one person when there's star shower is a mistake. Damn, bro. He just let that happen. Alright, let's go to the... Need more blue balls. Uh, that one's not gonna do it. I'm gonna need like two or three of them. I'm not gonna go out there and get cheesed by a fucking star shower. Close. Yeah, get him. Ah! Get him, please! Finish it! God damn it. I don't wanna deal with this fucking gang squad. Look at that shit. Look at that wizard right there. Alright, let's move on to the next one. I'm not getting cheese today. I refuse. Okay, there's like two or three blue balls over here.
This might be an opportunity. Maybe. Big maybe. Nothing. Somehow that didn't land. I didn't see him roll. Hmm. Maybe... Maybe the play... Oh shit, I'm in trouble. I'm not landing anything somehow. Bro, I'm over here. What the fuck are you doing? Jesus Christ. I managed to land something, thank god. Not doing so good with my wizardry today. Ah! What the fuck? I didn't even know he was coming. Yeah, you better get away from the fucking blue ball. These balls don't fuck around, man. Oh shit. Blue ball, protect! Yeah, get that motherfucker! Oh, somebody's down. Hell yeah. Oh, it was the host. See that? That fucking wizard right there. That wizard just being there spamming Star Shower made me play that invasion passive. Because if I would have tried to engage and fight them, I would have just got cheesed by Star Shower. Star Shower should not be in the game. It shouldn't. I try to use it as sparingly as I possibly can. <laughs> No, I have three vigor. <laughs> Bruh, that's probably what they're thinking, honestly. The host was uh the host was pretty persistent. He he paid for it because the blue ball electrocuted, you know. The lightning ball it got him. Drunk, love your YouTube videos. What about Orboro or Peeve in 1v1? What do you mean, 1v1? You want me to 1v1 them? I don't know those guys, really. I never talked to those guys too much. I, actually, probably not at all, honestly. I, I, I watch Ouroboro, Ouroboro streams a lot, but... I only, like, have... I don't think I've ever spoken to him directly. You think the four player count was created because Elden Ring is too damn big and the weaker consoles can't handle it. That's exactly why. The weaker consoles, PlayStation 4 and whatever the last Xbox was, they can't handle six players in the open world. So the only way they could give us six players per session in this game is to make a dedicated area where the game can handle it. And it's... It's entirely their fault for making this game available on last generation consoles. Last generation gaming consoles are not very strong. And when you make them available on the older generation of consoles, it just holds the game back. It holds the whole thing back, honestly. And you know, I'm no hate on the people that still have PlayStation 4 or anything, you know? Not everybody can just get a PlayStation 5. And they should be able to play too, right? Look at this dude's net. Holy shit. <laughs> Rivers go burr. <laughs> Rivers go burr. <laughs> okay. What was I saying? Uh, the people that, you know, couldn't get a PlayStation 5 or a new Xbox, they should get to play too. I can see why they, they made it available on the older gaming consoles. But at the same time, it did hold the game back. You know, that's the reason we don't have six-player limit. Sorry about the, the brain damage voice. Sorry about that. Carrying Piercer is perfect for shit like that, by the way. You can use it to outspace anything. And if you fully charge it... It does like 1500 damage, literally. It's fucking just, it's just perfect. Just perfect.
There's a ganker behind that rock. Hang on a minute. I've been up here before. We've been up here before, right? Yeah, this is the spot. Hang on. Let me see if that dragon's over there. Yeah, this is the, the shitty spot, dude. Last time I invaded here, the dragon got me. He fucking farted. And it just completely obliterated me when that dragon farted. <clears throat> I was like, big dragon, please protect me from the mean gankers, please. And the dragon fucking shits on me and I die. There's a blue too. Hmm. Where'd the other ones go? Bear, you quit barking. I gotta concentrate. There's a blue. Okay. You wanna fight? I wanna get rid of this blue before I engage the- Ah, I fucking knew it. They was trying to trap me, huh? Okay. Bear, please calm down. Please. Damn, no vigor. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, man. You know what? Oh, my God. That fucking vigor. Dude, that's... That's fucking... This will probably be easy, but the dragon's gonna kill me. Dragon's about to fucking kill me, dude. I'm gonna need all my buffs. I don't want to fight them up there where they have the advantage because, like, why would you? So I'm gonna try to drag them down here. No vigor build. Yeah, it'll take one piercer to get rid of that host, honestly. Damn, bro. Swift Shard be hitting hard. Holy shit. That is just absurd. <laughs> Rivers go bar. <laughs> Rivers! Oh, damn. He's lagging. He's lagging, bro. That's dangerous as fuck. Fire in a hole! I missed. Most unfortunate. Hmm. I'd be thinking. Whoa, dude. I didn't hear him coming. He tricked me. He's, yeah, he's lagging pretty hard, though. I need to go drink a blue. Yeah, there we go. I don't want to die to this dragon again. It might happen. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to bullshit you right now. Nothing up there. We need a starlight shard as well. This is probably going to be a long one. I'm definitely not going to come up here and let them beat me, though. That's not going to happen. The host is literally right there. Let's see if I can do it. Nothing. He must be smarter than he looks. The host is up there. I hear him walking around, trying to jump on me. Motherfucker. I almost had him. Nothing, dude. If I walk up here, the host is going to end up behind me. Oh, no. He's over there now. Okay. He abandoned his plan. Come on, motherfucker. Show me what you got. Ah, uh, nice poise you got there. What? Oh! That was fucking close, bro. That was extremely close. Raptor of the Mist is fucking bullshit. Wait, what the fuck? Why am I here? What did I do? <laughs> what the fuck, dude? <laughs> I totally messed that up. I'm thinking. I fucking I fucking hit R1 and then it it just my my menu just got fucked up. 
Dude, they're, they're trying this shit again. Ow! Jerk! Yes, come with me. Come on. Oh, he tried to raptors again. Oh, fuck! Bruh. You guys have way too much phantom range. It's actually shocking. A little bit. Hmm. I am gonna go ahead and... I'm gonna go ahead and heal up, because these guys are pissing me off. Kinda irritated by their passivity. Let's see what chat been saying. Yes, newer gaming consoles are extremely expensive. I don't blame those that couldn't get one. I mean, you know, not everybody can be expected to get a new PlayStation 5, you know, which is, it's understandable. Wait, do I have these on the fucking, uh, yeah, I do. I think I know where they're gonna be, and I can probably cannon. Surprisingly, that no vigor host is being extremely cautious. Behind me? Hello? Where's the other ones? He's right there. They're really trying to set up an ambush, bro. They're really trying. I don't know where the host is. Come on, chicken. I'm not fighting you up here. I got all day. This is my goddamn job. Get the fuck out of here, dude. That was not the host. What? He just swung anyway? Dude, he just fucking swung anyways. These people are so stupid. They almost tricked me every time. Alright, motherfucker. It's time to pay for your sins. I think that's a... Uh... What has he got there? That's the L2 blade. Now, I can't space this guy because he's got too much latency. Yeah, his, his latency's bad. I don't know if I'll be able to roll catch him either. There's one. There we go. Get the fuck out of here, dude. That was like the most pathetic gank I've ever seen in my life. Honestly, though. That dude is going to be pissed. That dude is going to be pissed. Oh, my God. He fucking deserves it, though. You see how passive those dudes were? Like, there's fucking three of you. You won't fight one invader, dude. Next to a dragon that's a bigger danger to me than them. Like, what the fuck? That dragon is more hazardous to the invader than them. Losers of the week. Mm. I don't know if that's worthy of losers of the week. I think that would be honoring them too much, honestly. Contenders? I, I mean, maybe. I, I have half a mind to keep that invasion, but it's so slow. You know, it's such a slow invasion. I don't think it would be good for a loser of the week YouTube video. Oh, you liked a magic knight fashion? That phantom was only level 90. <laughs> he had 20 vigor trying to fight like a tank, yeah? That's, that's about accurate, honestly. I mean, he seemed, like, cautious, but also stupid at the same time. Like, every time I thought I was gonna, you know, turn and burn, he barely just makes it. Just barely. Like, that dude was weird. He was, he was uh, unconventional, I should say. I, I also gotta say, Raptor of the Mist is fucking stupid. It's fucking dumb, dude.
Yeah, I will agree that the PlayStation 5 is very overpriced. Damn it, I wanted to get rid of one of his phantoms, but... The fact that it even lets you invade those places is just stupid. I get really tired of it. But invasions are slow today. Yeah, the dragons will purposely target invaders. Actually, all of the enemies do. Literally all the enemies do that in this game. They just kind of... They kind of act, like, sneaky about it. They don't want you to know that they're attacking invaders on purpose, but they do. Man, I missed so much of the chat while I was dealing with those passive gankers. So much of the chat. Wow. Uh, out of all my the gamer people I know, only like 20% of them have a PlayStation 5, so. They're not super common. People still have a hard time getting them, I guess. I don't know if it's because they're in short supply, the PlayStations, or if it's because, like, you know, they're expensive. I'm not sure which it is. Damn, host got lucky. There's a moon veil right there. I smell it. I smell the coward. Okay, and he's also got hand in Malardia. Damn, bro. Slicer mean as fuck. Ah! Oh, that was so unfortunate. That would have been so hilarious, bro. Don't get hand of Malardia. I don't want to get Malardia. So we're we're gonna end we're gonna head up the hill here get away from the L2 cheese that they're obviously going to try to do. The cool thing about being a wizard is that you can be really passive and annoy gankers until they move. I can just use Swift Shard all I want to get them to move. He's got a thrusting sword. Come on. Let's go. Uh, uh, did they get everything already? Yeah, it looks like they did get some of them. Damn it! So unlucky, bro. I tried. Dude, he poised fucking two of them! Get the fuck out of here. He fucking poised two slicers. That, that Usually they can only get two, but on the third one, he wasn't poised broken yet. Usually it's one, two, and then their poise is broke, but that took three, is what I'm trying to say. He had a lot of goddamn poise. A lot of goddamn poise. <sighs> Sorry, guys, I'm having technical difficulties. You want more night sorceries? I like them. I think night sorceries are pretty cool. They're not like the most spectacular thing ever, but they're pretty cool. Level 679? That explains all the goddamn poise and the defenses. But. Carry and Slicer still shredded him. And like, how many hits did it take? Like four? I think it took four hits with Slicer. To get his health to zero. More utility intelligence spells. I think uh, the way intelligence is, is good. I, intelligence is more combat oriented. While faith is more like varied. You know what I'm saying? Like the strength of intelligence is that it's just better for fighting. But the strength of faith is that faith has so many different applications. Applications. 
I want uh, Morgoth's uh, Faith Hammer, his spell, or his incantation, I mean. Ooh, Coward's Rock. Do we have passive gankers again? Let me check and see if it's a... Oh, it's a solo! Fuck you! Fuck you! I don't wanna! Fuck you! I checked. I checked to see if it was a solo. It was. You know, I never get invasions right here. In this spot. And this is the most, like, aesthetic place in the entire game. So I wish there was more invasions here. We, we don't really like solo hosts here. They're boring. Not only are they boring, but they do fake duels. It's really cringe. Ooh, this is where I should be. This is my, uh, my environment. My natural habitat. Fuck y'all! Ow! He actually staggered me out of that, wow. Crouch poke? Oh, I almost jumped off the fucking ledge, bro. I almost did. I want to get away from the bow. That's going to be really annoying. Serpentine, serpentine, serpentine. Ba bonk bonk bonk, ba bonk bonk bonk, ba bonk bonk bonk, ba bonk bonk bonk, ba bonk bonk bonk. Mm. What is the play here? That that bow is so goddamn annoying. You motherfucker. I don't like you. Yeah, I don't like you. Fuck you, buddy. Oh! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Bro, he came at me with the fucking super R2. That's insane. Oh! Oh, he's scary. I just need to heal. Fuck you. I just need to heal. Dude, he scared the fucking shit out of me. I was like... Uh, that was a genuine cry of fear when I when he came over and bonked me like that. I was genuinely afraid. I thought he was going to one-shot me. This will be tough, because he's going to have a billion poise. Bro, seriously? Do you not know how to play? I don't think he knows how to play. Oh, I'm out of blue. Hang on. I'm out of fucking blue. We're going to make sure we have full health, because that guy, he's going to hit like a goddamn truck. I'm going to keep punishing that every time you spam that. We'll use a piercer on him. Ah, shit. I messed up. We can't be, be near him after he rolls, because... Crouch poke. Really, bro? God damn it. I hate crouch poke so badly. You're just fucking poison through everything. Resummon? Crouch poke is a fucking mistake. Oh, <laughs> bruh. Uh-uh. This dude is just exploiting his hyper armor right now. Get the fuck out of here. Resummon that, motherfucker. Resummon that. Fucking loser of the week right here. No, not really. It wasn't that bad. But once you try to resummon on me, I get pissed off. Trying to fucking basically cheat the system. That's what he's trying to do. I'm gonna keep that invasion, just in case. Dude, Piercer is mean as fuck. If you panic roll... Piercer will ruin your fucking day. It will. And nothing I hate more than a goddamn resummoner. And a staller. People who stall so their fucking daddy can put their summon sign down. That guy was just exploiting his hyper armor too. 
He was just straight up crutching on hyper armor. Yeah, piercer goes through walls. It did. It does for sure. Uh. Damn it! I thought I could knock him off that ladder, but I guess not. We're gonna just like you know fire in the hole randomly. I. Whoa! Did I hit him? I did fucking hit him. Holy shit! We we gotta get down there and help the revenant. Uh, wait, hold on. Can I survive this jump, guys? I'm not sure. We gonna get him. We gonna get him real good. <laughs> we got him real good. <laughs> bro, Piercer, bro. Piercer is fucking stupid. Piercer is the carrion grandeur, but like longer. We got him real good. That's the part where I should have said, Frig off, Larry. God, I love Carrie and Piercer. It's the best spell in the game. <laughs> I'm gonna keep using Piercer, because it's fucking funny. It's like, oh, you made a panic roll? You made a mistake? Here's 1,500 damage, bitch. They're right down there. Oh, I'm gonna kerplode! It's fun to kerplode in this game, huh? Hello, sir. Why? Why can't you just play, dude? Shit. Another one. Damn it, I wanted it so bad. Out to the world. <laughs> Out to fun day. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the river's out of nowhere. We're gonna outspace him again. When's he gonna do it? Oh, uh, okay. Oh, sorry about that kerplode. Cannon of Haima. Uh, that's another thing. The kerplode. Cannon of Hyema is one of the strongest spells in the game also. Just gotta say that. Level 146 Phantom. The Phantom was underleveled. Well, maybe not underleveled, just on the lower side of the level bracket, basically. Damn, you guys really thought that ladder cheese was funny, huh? I only do that because I know they would do it to me. Yeah, Cannon of Haima and Piercer are the bestest. I agree with you. Uh, it put me in the wrong goddamn place again. Fuck! Ugh. It hurts me deep inside. I really don't like the Shaded Castle that much. It's just annoying to navigate it and find out where the host is. Hmm. So honestly, every time I come back to this area in this game, I, I get lost. Because there's always something stopping you from getting to where you need to go. Oh, bro, I thought I was stuck for a second. So where's the host at? Was I in the right place before? I think I was. Fire and hole! Bro, that was that was a legendary cannon shot right there. I'm gonna do it again too. Damn it. Fuck! I wanted it so bad. Oh shit, I'm being something's being thrown at me. I didn't hit nothing. They're gonna have to come down here. I can't go up there. Watch me just stand behind that wall. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> I love cannon so much. The kerplode is powerful. Damn it. Alright, I gotta stop wasting blue. Trying to get these stupid trick cannon shots. 
Um, I'm not... How do I get up there without... Maybe if I go over here, they'll come down. Because I don't think I can go up there unless I climb up there. Come on, it's okay. I need you guys to come down here so we can play the game. Motherfucker! Oh, that pissed me off. I'm gonna have to climb up the sneaky way. I think uh, this is the way. This is the way right here. Yes. And they didn't come down, so it's probably safe to go. Bear, stop your borking. Stop it now. It's okay. Everything's fine. I promise. Bear, calm down. I shouldn't have done this. I should not have came down here, but it's like either that or wait longer. I shouldn't have came down here with them because now I'm trapped down here. Oh, look at his net. Bro, you really just let me do that. He just let me fucking spam R1. That's crazy. That's fucking crazy talk, man. Did they go down now? It looks like they did, yeah. They ran the other way because I was distracted. Sometimes when I'm fighting a phantom like that, I just completely lose track of the host. Bear is very concerned. He's always concerned. Fuck you, buddy! Bro. <laughs> that host is gonna go fog wall now, bro. That host has got PTSD, you know. He's never gonna get on a ladder again. <laughs> bro. <laughs> God, get the fuck out of my way, you fucking piece of shit. Now I'm gonna get fog wall because that fucking zombie in my goddamn way. Fuck you. Please move the fuck out of the way. I want to get this host before he fucking fog walls like a coward bitch. Oh no. Did I fail? I think I failed. No way he could have got up here already, could he? No fucking way. Did he go to the lat? Did he go to the ladder or did he go up? I think he went up. Fucking PVE sabotaging me again. He used a rune arc. Maybe he plans to fight me. I mean, I doubt it. Yeah, hey, get in there, you fucking bitch. You're bitch made. Enjoy your solo boss fight. Wow. What a coward, bro. What a, what a coward. That, that, that invasion's not worthy of a loser of the week. Mission fail. We'll get him next time. I wish I could do a British accent, but I really can't. It's one of my weaknesses, British accents. You like how magic has gone from projectiles to giant, like, blue swords and shit? Yeah, me too. I like magic a lot better the way it is in this game. Although, spells like Star Shower? Complete cancer. This should not be in the game. Because it forces you to roll. There's nothing you can do. You have to roll. And that's how gankers will get you with random ass roll catches. Because gankers don't even know how to roll catch, but that, that spell will force you to roll. And then you get roll caught. Do we have a solo? Yep, we got a solo. Better luck next time. You like that cannon shot? That shit was pretty cool, huh? It usually takes me like five or ten invasions to get used to the wizard. Usually takes like a, a, a warm up period, basically, with this build. I think I, I think I'm there. I think I'm all warmed up with this build now. Oh man, another shitty place to invade that I'm gonna get fog walled in. I'm tired of all this chicken shit bullshit.
I hate that you can invade here, bro. I hate it. Oh, wait. The host might want to fight, maybe. Radonathan, you gotta be careful. You might get hurt, bro. Get spaced. That sword hits like a goddamn truck, so we need to be careful. Oh, he's summoning daddy number two. We gotta be careful. Those two, those two will get me in two hits, I guarantee it. If they manage to stun lock me, I'm done. I'm done. Uh, let's get the elevator just in case. Ah, damn it, I'm stuck. I need that elevator, but I'm gonna have to go this way. Alright, Radonathan. I shall never lose to a Radon again. Damn it, you fucking piece of shit. They both got so much poise, I'm not gonna be able to stagger him either. Please. Oh my god. That was close. No! Oh man. I didn't have the time. I didn't have the time. Oh man. That's cringe, bro. God damn. That's cringe. They got me trapped in a small room. I fucking hate invading here. I hate it so badly. One of the places you shouldn't even be able to invade. Nothing you could do on that one? I mean, probably not. Unless, unless Piercer managed to one-shot. Which it didn't. They also fucking summoned a third guy on me. Outplayed and saved. Yeah, I mean, that's fair to say. That's most of the time, honestly, on the host team. I'm doing okay. But yeah, I really think we shouldn't be able to invade places like that, because then you just end up with situations like that. There's just nowhere to go. There's nothing to do down there. I should have just taken the elevator up, but then they would have fogwalled me. Like that. Invading places like that forces you to either fight or get fog walled. You can't be tactical about it at all. If I broke off from that engagement, they would have fucking fog walled me. I think they were doing the boss, but they decided that they wanted to play when they had the miracle advantage. You know what I'm saying? If one of those phantoms got, you know, got got. They, they probably wouldn't have uh, wanted to fight anymore. They probably would have went to the fog wall. They only want to fight until one of the phantoms gets got in this game, basically. Well, they're, they're self-unaware, man. They don't, they don't understand how bad they are. Or how mediocre they are. When that happens, they really think that they're the shit. They really do. Coward's Rock. I think we have a, a farmer. Nope, nope, they're right there. It was pointing at the mausoleum thing, so I thought he was going to be a farmer. Oh, shit, there's three. Hey, there's a red in need. I will help indeed. Kind of looks like uh, Lord Stilovsky, doesn't it? You fucking suck. God, you're bad, bro. Stilovsky clone? Looks a lot like Stilovsky. Is that him? I don't think so. I'm going to let you take the host, because this is your invasion. It's, it's his invasion. He did all the work. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, I take that back. I had to do some other work. You you can finish him, Stolovsky. I could just swift shard, yeah. I could have just swift sharded that whole time, but... 
Is that Stolovsky? I don't know his actual name. I'm not sure. Pretty sure he doesn't play at 168 either. It's pretty much looked like a carbon copy of his build, though. I was gonna let him just take the host, cause you know it was he put in most of the work for that invasion, but the host kept panic rolling, and I was like, man, I got I gotta roll catch this dude. Yeah, I don't think that was Stolovsky either. I was mostly joking, but it it's definitely a Stolovsky clone for sure. <laughs> the only thing it was missing was the dual lances or great bow basically has anyone ever parried carry and slicer yeah for sure that's happened before you intentionally invade there to train against gankers i mean that's not that's pretty smart i guess oh hang on i think i got a dumb comment hang on Damn, you complain the three before and what you do? What are you talking about, bro? I, I think what you're saying is, how can you be, how he's like saying, how can you be upset when they act cocky? But then you turn around and act cocky. Well, I'll tell you what, it's because there's a difference between me and Gankers. I'm one person playing against the odds. I have every advantage stacked against me. They don't. They have it on easy mode. So when they act arrogant, it's pretty cringe. But when the invader rightfully wins an invasion and rightfully asserts dominance, not cringe. There's a difference. You gotta understand the, the power dynamics here. Invaders are the underdogs. So it's kind of justifiable when we want to assert dominance and be funny. But if you're just standing there ganking, you know, you're just relying on daddies to win, then you don't get to act, you don't get to act arrogant. That's cringe as hell. I mean, don't bother to explain to that dude. Well, I, I know he probably doesn't have a grasp on the game, but you just got, sometimes you just gotta... You just gotta, like, educate, you know? You gotta educate the player base about the game. And if if he goes on to say more dumb shit to other content creators, then that's on him. At least I tried. At least I tried. You are arrogant and trash talk. Yes, I do. Yes, I most certainly do. This man is not happy. I wonder if he was uh, one of these hosts in the game. Bruh. Come on now. I just want to play. I just want to play the game, bro. What the fuck? He's he's just bitching because I'm an invader and I'm winning. That's why. They did. PVEers just hate seeing an invader win. That's pretty much it. It's not that he's actually offended. He's just pissed off that an invader does well. PvE hosts want to believe that they're invincible, but that's not quite how it works. He doesn't understand how the game works. Yeah, I agree. You can't be talking about something you're clueless on. You can't be doing that, because then you're going to look stupid. It's like one of the first lessons in life. Don't talk about what you don't know about. 
But you do it anyway, because you're fucking... I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with you. Honestly. I don't know what happened to you. I don't know why you're like that, but you can be like that if you want to. But you're gonna get made fun of for it. You guys think I'm too mean? Some people think I'm too mean. Oh, we got a fat roller. Oh! Got a fat roller here. Bro, he just... Seriously, bro. He just stood there. Seriously. What the fuck? How are you fat rolling at 168? There's a wizard. I'm gonna out-wizard you in a second. Gotta watch out for the phantom. Oh, he's got the spinny slash. Or the spinny staff. Oh shit. I almost walked into a fucking rock. Really the fucking moon, bro? God damn. I hate the moon spell. It's so annoying. We really gotta watch out because he's just spamming and then there's a strength build right there. Is he doing the glitch with the bow? I think he is. Don't want to be near that wizard. I can't fight him because he's just going to keep spamming at me. This is not a talented wizard, but the fact that he's got a strength build right here makes him dangerous. Damn it. That was a bad lock on. My bad. He's gonna do that spin thing. I guarantee it. See, this is why you gotta be careful even if there's a dumb wizard. If, if the numerical superior team has a wizard, you're in trouble in this game. Oh, I got one. He's using the glitch on me, isn't he? Is he bow glitching? It kinda looked like he was bow glitching, honestly. He's got unlimited blue right now. Oh, I don't want to get the spin staff, dude. That, that's just going to one-shot me. Why would you use that, bro? No comprende. Ugh. Get him, boy. How you like that? You just got out-wizarded, motherfucker. How you like that? Spam some shit at that. Biatch. The cheese staff? Um, it's just the spinning weapon, Ash of War, on the Carrion Regal Scepter. That's, if you get caught in it, you literally can't roll out. It just infinitely combos. Let me catch up with chat for a minute, because... I've been kind of negligent towards my chat. I'm just saying what you're all thinking anyways. I mean, yeah, I agree. I, I say what I think. That's pretty much my only attribute. That's my entire personality trait, really. <laughs> my one singular personality trait is that I, that I say what I think. Damn, he was mad as fuck, wasn't he? God damn. Some people are sensitive, bro. I'm just now catching up with this and seeing what, what that guy said. Because drunk earned his confidence. I mean, I, that's an interesting take right there. That is, that's what you said, and I'm not sure if that's the case. Have I earned my confidence? I don't know. <laughs> but I know who didn't earn their confidence, and it's gankers. They're the ones who have not earned their confidence. Because they ain't good.
You wish that bonking with the staffs in this game was effective? I think I've won an invasion by just, just hitting with the staff one time. I think I did. And I'm not sure how the host got hit by it either. It's literally like the worst move in the game though. Do you know if magic swords like Carrion Greatsword or Carrion Piercer or even Carrion Grandeur can be reflected using the Erdtree Great Shield? No, they cannot. They cannot. You're actually the most realistic invader. I, f I, I don't know how you word that either, but I get what you're saying. I understand. Realistic is, I mean, maybe it's just that I say what other invaders are thinking, you know? Hello. Look out! God damn. I'll give him like 10 seconds to wake up. Oh, you're under leveled, aren't you? This is not good. Oh, this guy's got that net, dude. He's got that fucking terrible net. Look at this. I'm gonna have to step, like... Spacing is gonna be impossible. Oh, bruh. Whoa, dude. Whoa. That's actually a little much. That's a little much. That is desync if I ever done seen it. Ah! Oh, shit! Bruh! Alright, that guy's getting blocked. That That's a little much, dude. That's a little excessive. That is just unreasonable fucking desync. Did you see how far away he fucking hit me, dude? God damn. That's fucking awful. I, I blocked that host. That's that's a that's a bit much. That's that McDonald's Wi Fi. Dude, he hit me from like 10 feet away and he hit it early too. He's literally hitting me early. I was like, how the fuck am I supposed to avoid this? Thank you guys for all the support, by the way. When someone dumb comes in the chat, we gotta educate them about the game. Gotta make sure they know. And if they choose to still be ignorant after that, that's on them. But at least we tried. We tried to educate them about the game and its dynamics and all that. Solo? Yep, it's a solo. Later, bro. Have fun not fighting me. You know, you can, you can waste somebody else's time. It just ain't gonna be me, you know? Yeah, Chase is really, really good at being, like, he, he makes veiled insults. Like, it doesn't sound like he's insulting them, but you can kind of tell he is, in a way. Chase is, Chase is very smooth with the way he speaks. He's actually a bit perplexing, honestly. I, I can't hide my, my thoughts like that. Like, I just bluntly say what I think. Right, but Chase will say like something kind of kind of suave, you know, something kind of intelligent that you know it, it it doesn't sound like an insult on face value, but it is an insult. I have no charisma. I just I just be saying shit. Oh, let's use a red. Let's see if we can get up on that wall. I don't think that's why Chase is nice. I think he's just nice because he's nice.
We have a waves of piss enjoyer here. Wakey, wakey! Well, thank God that's over. Don't do it, bro. He tried to swing out a hit stun. You see that slicer, bro? Slicer is fucking stupid. Oh, there was a third one. I could have had more fun, but. Yeah, Chase has got some charisma. Like, the nice guy type of charisma. There's two different kinds of charisma, though. There's, like... There's, like... Uh... Like, mean dude charisma, and there's nice dude charisma. You know, there's two different kinds. I don't know what those dudes were doing, to be honest with you. I don't know. Have I missed any donations? I always get so paranoid about missing the donations. I feel so bad when I miss a donation. Looks like I'm all caught up, though. I'm just not very good at reading the chat. When I'm trying to play, I literally, like, barely look at the chat at all. Because it's just, you know, I want to win. Damn, bro! Fire in the hole! How the fuck is he gone already? You guys got a level vigor, man. Maybe my build's just broken. We, we need some good invasions. <laughs> we need like a like more good ones because these hosts are just not, they're not making it very far. I think my build is completely broken. That's kind of what I said in the title of the stream. It is broken. It requires thought process to use. But it is broken. How can you be mean and charismatic at the same time? Well, there you be mean in a charismatic way. You you be you be mean in a, in a smooth way of speaking. You know what I'm saying? Coward's Rock. No. Fuck. Oh, it's not a solo. I thought he was solo for a second. Dude, you guys can't... Come on, please play the game. Oh, the host is going to come at me now. Hang on. I wonder if these guys are ganking here. Because the host isn't doing nothing. Damn it. I have no poise. I need some poise. Dude, Slicer is so fucking mean. Jesus. I think there's another invader. Yeah. Hey, dude. You want the host? Come get this host. Is this a fight club? Oh, that's why the host wasn't attacking me. This is a fight club. Oh, fuck. That was a waste of time as well. A lot of invaders don't like solo invasions because we want to be outnumbered. It's just not as rewarding if you're not outnumbered. You know what I'm saying? Like, winning, winning against one player is never going to be the same level of satisfaction as winning against three. Or, you know, when there's more of them than there are of the invader. They, they don't duel in the Coliseum because 
you can't heal in the Colosseum. And if they can't heal, they would lose. So they they do it out in the environment of the game where they can heal and basically cheat because they have double heals. Nope. Oh shit! Desync again. Yeah, it's desync. Shit. He's trying his damn best. Look at him. He's trying his damn best. He's doing the best he can out here. Oh no, my banished daddy. Come back. I need your help. Somehow that landed. I don't know. Dude, these guys are desync like a motherfucker. Please go away. God, your net is so fucking bad. Holy shit. That's some terrifying level net right there. What do I add to the the flask in this game? Um, sometimes it's health regeneration. Sometimes it's light roll. Sometimes it's the magic damage one. Sometimes it... I mean, there's all kinds of shit you can put in the flask with this build. It's dumb how easy it is to get a healing incantation off. I agree. Urchery heal is kind of stupidly fast to the point where you can't even really punish it. The only thing that's an issue is Urchery heal because it's literally so fast that you can't react and punish it. Even if you're like right next to it when it's being cast. But the other healing spells, they're fine. They're absolutely fine. It's just that one that's a little bit borderline unpunishable. Because they don't have to finish the healing animation to get all the health back. All they have to do is cast it, and then it works. And then their, their entire health bar is back. So even if you do manage to hit them out of it, they're still going to get that health. That's only Urge Reheal, though. All the other ones are fine. Fire in a hole! Oh shit! Jar cannon? Oh no. I'm gonna get ganked down here, aren't I? Oh shit! No, 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 no! That dude's just L2 in the world. Damn it! I, I didn't wanna get fog walled. I'm trying my best. trying my damn best just don't let us invade next to the fog wall anymore please Mizaki yeah I mean if you got healing spells as a part of your build and you invested part of your build to use them then use them that's fine but the only one that's a little bit unbalanced is Urchery heal it's a bit too much in duels honestly three people and they're still scared yeah that's a story of my life oh shit gankers and fucking maybe maybe gankers and uh ashen capital it's not a good place to get ganked at all will you just wildly swing at me yes you will God, you guys gotta stop panic rolling. You panic roll against Slicer, you're done. That's that's it. You're gonna get roll catch for 500 damage like five times in a row. Like, just don't panic roll. 
He's trying to summon again. Oh, I'm getting fog walled again, maybe. Hold on, we'll find out. Hello? Piercer is so stupid. These invasions are a bit too easy. Hello, hello, howdy. How we doing? Having a pretty decent stream today. I decided I would do a... I would do a wizard stream again, because yesterday's was cut short. Piercer is overpowered, I agree. In a good way. It The attack animation for Piercer is like... It has like a lingering hitbox. So even when it shouldn't roll catch, in theory, it still does. Oh shit, I hate fighting around these bosses. Do I do it? Fuck it, I'ma do it. <laughs> Wake up! The bad red man is here. The bad red invader is here to ruin your gameplay. I'm here to make you miserable, obviously. That was Miyazaki's vision. Don't fucking swing out of hits, stun, dude. Stop it. You're gonna make this invasion too short again. And I would like to play. Let's go ahead. That was the wrong player. I didn't mean to do that. God damn it. Piercer did it again. Piercer did it again. Motherfucker. It's not your fault, Mr. Host. It's not your fault. My build's just broken. You see that phantom not even helping him? That phantom just let him get shredded. Fucking stupid. Crimson World Bubble Tier? That's one of the better flasks in this game, honestly. Um, if you combine it with the Infinite Poise Physic Flask, um, it basically just makes you invincible for 15 seconds. And I used to use that on my Wizard Hunter against Wizards. It worked really fucking well, actually. Easy 15 seconds to get rid of that Wizard. Where the host at, though? Oh, shit! He's right fucking here. Oh, he's fucking crazy, just l 2 in. Stop. Sir. Sir, you gotta get a grip. Oh, shit. I'm gonna die up here? I don't wanna die up here. Alright, we'll try to outspace that again. Do not swing out a hit stun against fucking Slicer, dude. You can't be doing that shit. I don't really uh, host in this game. I don't really. Because that's not very fun, you know? First of all, if you host, you get ganker advantage. You know that you and the phantoms can't hit each other in this game, if you're on the host team. And also, I would just rather be the red in this game. Four slicers, about 1500 damage, yes. I think every slicer is going to do about four or 500 damage on this build. And that is absurd. Probably shouldn't be that way, but it is what it is. Uh, I need another. One sec. 
I do be vaping. I do be vaping. Solo? No, there should be a second player here. Hold on. Uh, the elevator's down. I ha I have an escape. Oh, it's a solo. Just call in blues. Hang on. Whoa, dude. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Ah! Okay. I managed to escape and not get trapped down there again. I'm not gonna fight the solo that's just calling blues. I'm not gonna do that. I fucking can't stand solo host, man. Fucking can't stand them. Listen, bro. Even the absolute best invader is still probably going to lose against three players. They have so much of an advantage. Like, they have so many safety nets to make sure they win in this game. And they have so many advantages that they have to be really, really bad to lose. Like, really bad. So... Bro, are you serious? These invasions- they're just giving me easy mode invasions. What the fuck? But yeah, you, you gotta be really bad to lose on the host team. You gotta be pretty bad. If you want a duel, go to the arena. That's a good- that's a good point. We have an intellectual here. He'd be using the cracked magic tier in this game. Yeah, that, that's a good choice on this build, honestly. But I prefer... The strongest flask is definitely the health regen. The health regen is it's big. It's a lot. And there's going to be times where you can't heal. You just have to run. And that, 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 that flask is going to save you in this game. Why do you hate solo hosts? Well, I've said it a million times, but if you're really curious, Saint Riot has a YouTube video about this. Why invaders hate solo hosts. And I, I share most of his opinions. Uh, rather than explain myself again, I would just, you know, refer to Saint Riot's YouTube video. Invasions with multiple players attacking you is so much better. Solo hosts are boring. They're often trying to basically cheat in a duel anyways. You know, solo hosts have got double heals and a rune arc. And invaders don't have that. And they'll usually heal on you when they start losing. And then it's just going to become who can heal the most. And that's always going to be the host because they have double. You know what I'm saying? It's cringe, man. They, they do that because they're not good duelists. They're not good players. They can't win if they can't heal. There's got there's got to be advantages for those people. That's why they do it. Fuck. Invasions are getting weird, bro. I keep getting easy ones for some for some reason. I mean, easy ones or like it's just not an invasion. You know, when I play through the game, I like to be invaded too, but i it's not a surprise anymore. You have to literally ask to be invaded now. Like, it used to be a tense thing knowing that if you used a humanity or an ember in these games, uh, an invader could show up at any time, any random time, no matter how, how hard you're ha how, how, how hard of a time you're having in the game. It doesn't matter, a red can just show up like like Mr. X from Resident Evil, and then you gotta fight him. You know what I'm saying? That's not a thing anymore, because you're expecting to get invaded. It, it takes the magic away. 
it, it's just a it was a bad design decision to to make you know you have to ask to be invaded by either summoning phantoms or using taunters that's so stupid the the entire dynamic is just taken away when you do that and it's it's Miyazaki's vision don't question it that's another thing I've been bitching about for a long time I don't even play through the games anymore because you can't get invaded randomly I think that using rune arcs should be the same as ember in Dark Souls 3. So yeah, you should be able to be invaded just for using one. Whoa, what was that? Oh no, there's a wizard behind me. Shit. Ah! Oh! oh! Damn, bro, I didn't even hear that guy behind me. Damn, that did a lot of damage, bro. Dude, he can still hit me from that far. Oh, no! Bro, the rock, no! Fuck you. No! God damn it! Oh, bro, you fucking cringe, bro. God damn. They were throwing way too much shit. They were throwing way too much shit. But I I'm, I made a mistake there. I thought I was out of range of the, the L2. Of that, that Falling Star Beast jaw. And I got hit by it anyway. So I was just incorrect. But I also ran into a rock, so there's that. No. Don't don't get mad about it. They're just bad players that want to feel good without getting good. That's why they're ganking like that. You don't don't be bothered by people like that because they are just untalented players that want to feel good. That's all it is. They don't act arrogant to make you mad. They act arrogant to make themselves feel good. Solo host again? Is this a solo... God damn it, I'm so sick of these solo hosts, bro. This is why I don't like solo hosts. Did you see that? He was gone in 30 seconds. That's why we don't like solo hosts. It's too easy. It's either too easy or they heal. And then it's just miserable. A slog. The perf the perfume uh, consumables. What, what? How would that complement my magic build? I've never used any of those, honestly. I only have three characters in this game, dude. These invasions suck today. Actually, fucking suck. Wow. The host is in there, bro. The host is in there. He's gonna have to do a solo boss fight now. I don't think I can hit him through the fog. Oh, yes I can. I for sure can. He's gonna try to cheese me through the fog now. <laughs> Bro, what a dumb invasion. These are so stupid today. I don't know why. They're just stupid.
I keep getting, like, the worst fucking invasions. It's either just bots or fucking fog wall or something like that. I don't know why I can't get regular invasions. Or it's just some fucking cringy gankers in an open field. You know, it's just not... There's no normal invasions. I know he could have used the serpent blade and hit me through the door. I would have uh, put him in the loser of the week video for that on YouTube. I would have definitely put that in my loser of the week YouTube video. Because that's just stupid. They uh, they can hit you from basically anywhere if they use the serpent hunter. And it works like it does when they're in the boss room if they do it that way. Yeah, I, I don't, I've never really used the perfume consumables. I want to use spark. Uh, what is it called? Spark consumable? I want to try to use that at level 40. I think it'd be really strong. I was going to put it on the tarnished hunter. Okay. Mm. Looks like we might have a normal invasion. Maybe. Um. No? Oh, did I? I think my wife is home. Not sure, though. One sec, guys. I gotta figure out. I gotta figure out where the host is at. He is right there. You guys gotta stop panic rolling. Stop it. Get some help. Okay, I just wasted co uh, fucking cannons for no reason. <laughs> um, fucking, I'll do it. I'll come up here. Fire and all. That's not where you wanna be, but. Wait. Oh, he's right there. Hang on. I'm gonna have to make them... Oh, shit. I made a mistake. They wanted me to come up here so they could trap me up here. They're trying to trap me on a small platform. Oh, shit, bro. Damn it, bro, they ran off. Hello? Bro. Watch me just walk over here. He's still holding the bow, I think. Bro, this guy, I can't fucking play until you stop that. Hello? Uh, let's use Star Shower, because they're kind of annoying me. Mm, should I go down there? Because they're going to get me trapped in this little area, and that's not what I want. Maybe Swift Shard? Oh, no! No! Oh, I thought I was dead, bro. Damn, how am I going to get them down from there? Because I'm not fighting them up there. There we go. Okay, now we're good. Just needed them to come down. I don't want to get trapped in a small space. That's how you win invasions, is by not getting trapped. Ooh, Moonvale. Uh, I think he's got Vigor. Ow. Oh, shit. I'm gonna have hyper passive dudes, I think. I wish I had my parry for that moon veil, but I don't.
Nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, there's there's some right there. There's some damage. I gotta encourage them to move through the level. Because I'm gonna tell you guys a secret. If one of them has a moon veil, you don't get to play. At least not the normal way. Because every time you try to play, they're gonna moon veil you. Uh, okay then. Damn, no vigor. Holy shit. That guy's got no goddamn vigor, but he's he's using veterans like he's a tryhard. Like, what the hell? Nothing. That was a failure of a cannon right there. I see the donation. I promise I'll get to it. I just don't want to lose against passive gankers. I have to be smart. I'll make it not worth it to stand in that healing. Ooh, I almost got hit by that. Alright, we're gonna have to drink a blue. I'm almost out. Because I've been trying to get these guys to move for so long. Come on, chicken. Yeah, come on, chicken. See, that's why I can't play right there. If I try to play, he's just going to moon veil. Here he goes again. You're the reason I'm being passive. God damn it. Alright, let's see if this gets him to move. We'll try this maneuver right here. Yep, see, that pissed him off. That guy's random as fuck. Actually, though. He just kept R1-ing. Kind of surprising. Worth. I'll just heal that up. It's okay. These guys are not fucking pushing. They refuse to push. Alright, let's just stay and gather a little bit more health. I think they ran backwards. No, they're right here. They're right fucking here. Yeah, gotta watch that guy, because he just randomly presses R1. He's a little bit weird. Whoa, dude. Desync? Okay. Get the fuck out of here. You're so passive. So goddamn annoying. I still... I remember that donation still. Don't worry. I'm gonna get to it. I just don't want to lose this one because they're pissing me off. And see why they were so passive. They don't have no fucking vigor. And now he's gonna run all the way back to the bonfire because he doesn't want to lose gonna try to resummon his daddy he needs daddy he can't play without daddy mm, I have to get there and stop him before uh, I'm out of stamina too damn it he's gonna resummon please let me roll catch Dude, his net. What the fuck? God damn, you're a fucking coward, bro. That actually irritated me a lot. Like, run all the way back to Bonfire. Just because you're not winning. Like, fuck you. God damn. Loser of the week? Maybe. <laughs> that might be a contender. Okay, we're gonna keep that invasion. Okay, I'm so sorry that it took me a while to get to the donation, but I, I, I'm gonna say your name is Waro, War Warat. I don't know, bro. I, I, I if I knew how to say it, I would. But I really, really appreciate the the five dollars, my dude. It makes a big difference for me, you know. Content creators need your support. 
especially the ones on YouTube. The sweaty players aren't... Uh, I mean, I don't know if I would call them sweaty. I don't know if I would call them sweaty, to be honest with you. I think they were just scared, honestly. They didn't seem very sweaty. Dude had, like, 20 vigor, you know? Does it make sense to put Ashes of War on a staff? I'm not really sure. Well, with the Carrion Regal Scepter, it has a really good Ash of War. Uh, the Carrion Regal Scepter Ash of War is so broken, it's like, it's like taboo to use it in this game. Because <laughs> it, it just stunlocks people infinitely, but other than that one, I don't think there's any good Ashes of War for uh, staffs. For wizard wizard sticks. I'm not sure about that last invasion, but it might end up as a loser of the week, maybe. Now, uh, I'm in the wrong place, guys. Jitters are so predictable. I mean, you're not wrong. Uh, please put me where I need to go. Please. Yeah, they're almost as bad. Dude, they were at the fucking boss fog. And I was put at the beginning. Carry a manor is almost as bad as fucking... Castle Soul, yeah. Oh, thank God. I thought I was going to get fog wall, dude. Slicer is so mean. Look at this. That is just broken, dude. My God. They were going to fog wall me, so I don't feel bad. Can you guys give me just a second? I got to get up for just a second, okay? Okay, I'm back. Oh, shit. These invasions have taken a toll on me today. They've been a little bit stupid today. Honestly, though. You guys are kind of funny sometimes. <laughs> Let's hope we, ha we have some good invasions. Hope we get some good ones. My stomach kind of hurts. I'm not feeling the greatest right now. Fire in a hole! You just got out-wizarded. See, this is the wrong kind of wizard. The one with the fishbowl on his goddamn face. Oh, I'm gonna try to backstab him, but I can't. That would be stupid. I should not try to backstab. Jesus, this guy is... Slicer is a... Is a... Stupid. Oh, well, he's lagging real hard. Oh, dude, you, you are lagging your fucking face off. Holy shit. Okay, thank you, Piercer, for saving me from that. He was lagging his goddamn face off. See, 
See? Wizard is overpowered. It is. It's fucking overpowered. This build is too good, man. That's why I don't use it that often, because every time I use it, invasions be like easy mode. Sushi master? Really? I mean, <laughs> that would be kind of funny. There is absolutely nothing wrong with duplicating items in this game. Nothing wrong. It has the exact same effect as if you had gathered them organically in the game. It's it's the exact same. It doesn't make any difference how you got the items in the game. They still work the same way. And most most invaders wouldn't most invaders wouldn't duplicate if hosts and phantoms weren't, but they do, so. Shut the fuck up. God damn. Oh. I think we have gankers, maybe. Ooh, he's got defense, bro. He's got defenses. Holy shit. That guy is tanky as hell. Mm, he wants to stay by his host, but I can't fight by the host because he has too much spam. He has, oh no, magic defenses. It's probably stream snipers. Mm. Nobody uses that unless they're intending to fight me specifically. I need to get past them and get to the PvE that's down in the hallway. At least that's the plan, and if they're watching the stream, they're going to hear that, but... I have a co-invader that might be that might save me from losing this one because they they are ready to fight me as you can see please wake the fuck up you idiot no I must win oh thank god thank god bro I hope that was a stream sniper because that was embarrassing, if so. Magic Fortification, it's like really situational now. So I usually think that if I run into a Taunter's host who's using Magic Fortification, you know, specifically against me, they're probably stream sniping. They're probably trying to fight me specifically. I, I'm, you know, I run wizard all the time. Yeah, honestly, if hosts and phantoms didn't duplicate items in this game, I wouldn't. But there, everybody else is already doing it, so you may as well do it. It's just one of those things that, you know, it's an error on from software's part for having that in their games. Everybody does it because everybody can do it, you know. If you choose not to do it, you're handicapping your own gameplay, you know. Yeah, farming for items in this game fucking sucks, man. I'm not surprised duplication got so popular in this game. But the items have the same purpose, however you got them. That's how these games are. Yep, I'm in the wrong place, guys. 
Yay! Miyazaki's vision! Yay! Yeah, the amount of uh, consumables is limited per per gaming session, basically. You can't have more than 10 Starlight Shards in an invasion. You know, stuff like that. So that's probably good, right? Because if you could have, like, infinite, then that would be uh, even worse. We have a solo. Oh, wait. Yeah, it said he was solo. My first language? Why are you asking me that? I thought it was obvious. My first language is Midwest. Or was he not talking to me? There, there be dudes on the tree branch right now. Code red. Oh, 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 oh! Get away from me! This is not a good place to invade because you get stuck in this little enclosed space. I don't like it at all. And the only other option is the swamp, which is worse. I'm gonna start bonking. If they scare me enough, I'm gonna start bonking everything, dude. Oh! <laughs> oh no! Not the madness cheese. That's not good. That's pretty lame, honestly. Got the bow. Dude, that somehow still came over. That's wild. I'm trapped here. I really don't want to play here. Oh my god, how did you live? How? Bro. Dude leveled his vigor at least. God damn. I love being a wizard so much. I love being a wizard. It just saved me from a really shitty situation. Yep, I for sure have that Midwest accent. For sure. Have a good one, Beefy. Thanks for coming to my live stream. I appreciate all the support. Sorry I'm so bad at keeping up with the chat. Hey, wait a minute. They're right by the door, aren't they? Yeah, let's... Huh. Really, bro? That's what you're doing? Really? There's three here. I'm gonna back off. There's three here. The other two are about to jump out. Yep, there they are. Oh, two wizards right now. There's two wizards. That means I gotta move. Is the dragon gone? Looks like it. I need... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's hitting early a little bit. His collapsing stars is hitting me in a weird way. It's hitting early. That's not good at all. There's no good PvE here either, so... Not even sure why I came up here, but... It is what it is. But all I needed was one comet. You got out-wizarded, bitch. 
That's an intelligence faith build, huh? Go ahead and cast another spell, stupid. I dare you. Get him, boy. Get him. Get the stinky ganker. Get him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You got out wizarded, motherfucker. Good doggy. Good boy. People still not level in vigor. <laughs> that was a good one, wasn't it, guys? I appreciate all the support today, everybody. Whether you're, whether you're just a viewer or you donate or whatever. I appreciate all of it. I'm going to have to leave in a hurry here in a little bit. I know I'm not going to get a chance to say thank you. Holy shit! The storm motivated with the... Not sure what currency that is, but there's 27 of it, bro. And that's quite a lot. 27 is a big number, so... I, I really appreciate it, my dude. I really, really fucking appreciate it. My contribution to one of the best Souls YouTube channels. Aww. <laughs> bro. <laughs> Aw, that warms my heart a little bit. Thank you for the, Thank you for the support, though. You guys are really great about that, in general. When are you also going to stream on Twitch? Probably soon. I think it's a... Uh, there's two. There's two. Um, hang on, let me back off. I know there's a phantom in the bushes. But, um... What was I saying? Oh, yeah. Uh, I prefer YouTube. YouTube has been very good to me. But I'm definitely going to try Twitch every now and then. Eventually. Got magic fortification. I wonder if he's trying to fight me. I wonder if it's a stream sniper or if it's just, you know, happenstance. Are we dueling? Where's your... You better get out, daddy. He better come help you or I'm leaving. This is why invaders don't like dueling. This is why, right here. One sec, guys, I gotta mute real quick. Yeah, my wife is home. She always scares the shit out of me, dude, because I don't realize she's here. And she's just there, you know? A lot of stream snipers will try to use magic fortification against me, just because I play wizard so much. Well, what a great invasion, Miyazaki. Thank you. Yeah, I, I do get pretty into the video game. I do. Well, that's not always true. Like, for easy invasions or, like, average invasions, I'm kind of on autopilot most of the time. Like, it's just... Invasions are kind of an instinctual thing, you know, that you just get used to and then, you know, you just do it without really thinking. But when I really start thinking hard and getting in the zone is when I get, like, gankers or super passive players or, you know, some other type of, like, just annoyance, basically. Like, half the invasions today have been on autopilot just... I was more focused on talking to the chat than actual, uh, uh, fucking invasion for some of them. Not a lot of vigor on that guy.
Am I getting ganked right now? One sec. Okay. I'm ready now. I had to fix something with my stream. Ah, damn it. Oh, dude, I can't go through there. Fuck. Dude, I hate all these obstacles. Fuck this shit. I'm tired of all these obstacles. Get out of my way. Is the dogs here? I don't... Or the lions? I need the PvE. There's a spinning slash. That means I have to be passive as hell for a minute. Um, I don't think there's any PvE here. So this is a real gank, huh? I don't... Ah, oh, shit. There's nothing good I can use. Hang on, let me look the other side. If there's a spinning slash on the field, you better be super cautious, because... Spinning slash takes no fucking thought at all. It just magically roll catches for you. Oh, no. Fog wall, maybe? Damn it! Bro, that was supposed to go over the barricade. Fuck you. Oh, shit. No PvE. Ah! Damn it, bro. I didn't know he was there. I got too hasty. Bruh, nice gank, bro. Holy shit. I'm just overpired. I'm overpired. Slicer go burr. Holy shit. Ryan Crabtree with the $10 donation. Thank you so much, my dude. Again, that is quite a lot to give to a streamer. I really appreciate it. Love seeing your YouTube channel active. Aw. <laughs> you guys got kind words and shit, huh? Well, that makes me feel better about some of these, you know, cr cringy invasions I'd be getting. You know, kind of boosts my ego a little bit. And the donation goes a long way to make sure I can even make YouTube content. Every YouTuber needs a bit of an ego boost every now and then, you know. Yeah, it, it, your favorite YouTuber, they could probably use your kind words. Because YouTube will drive you crazy. It literally drives you fucking insane. And despite popular belief, YouTubers are not especially confident. We're not. Our egos aren't actually that big. They're actually probably low. Because like, every time something goes wrong on YouTube, you start to lose ego. And it all adds up to make you feel like, wow, I'm, I'm just a piece of shit. I'm not a good YouTuber. I'm a bad YouTuber, and that's how I feel half the time. But then then my viewers are like, nah, bro, are you good? I'm like, yeah, maybe I am good, you know? So it's it's kind of like a... It's kind of like a double-edged sword there. Where the fuck is the host? Oh, they're up... Oh, shit. Okay, hang on. Bro, what the fuck? Huh? Okay. This is, uh, not good. Oh, shit. I just gotta get through, bro. 
I just gotta get through, man. I'm just passing through. They were trying to cheese me, huh? Oh, shit. He's right there. It's dark. I can't see. Damn, you're persistent, aren't you? That guy is really persistent. It actually surprised me a little bit. Damn it! Fuck you, Piercer. Why you gotta fail me when I need you? Bonk. Oh, damn it. I got my spell order messed up. I thought I had Piercer after Gavel, because that's how I usually have it. Waves of Piss go burr. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So funny. Pretty colors. <laughs> I need to be careful. We're gonna try something kind of brave. Damn it. It didn't work out. That's what I get for trying to be brave. I'm gonna go up. I don't want to get cheese down here in this little area. Not good. So, I'm gonna see if they'll come up. Let me see if they come up real quick. Okay, they do be coming up. So now we can lay a trap. I'll try to time this right. No promises, though. Fuck you, buddy! Fuck you! You've activated my trap card. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> that was a good one. That was that was funny. Rookie mistake. <laughs> Let me catch up with the chat real quick. Piercer's always got your back, eventually, you know. It might fail you a couple times, but it'll eventually have your back, you know. You love it when they activate the trap card. <laughs> that was a pretty funny one, I'm not gonna lie. But, guys, uh, thank you for... Bear! Bear! Calm down! Relax! Everything's fine! Thank you for all the donations and, you know, the, 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 the happy viewership today on my channel. I really, really appreciate it, you know. Like, really, really appreciate it. Y'all you don't, you don't even know how much I appreciate it. I'm not being ironic either. But, I have to get off. I got another thing I have to do today. I, I, I would prefer to stream for, like, four hours instead of, you know, two or three, but... It's not quite how it goes sometimes, so I, I really appreciate you guys watching my live stream and supporting, but I hope to see you guys in the next one. I don't have anybody to, I don't have another streamer to send you to today, I just, I gotta get going, but again, thank you guys.